Hello everybody and welcome to the channel. My name is of course Constantine and today in the world of indie games we're gonna be checking out a brand new one that has just been released. This one is called A Juggler's Tale and it is something that I've been following for quite some time. I think more than a year or so. And the first time I saw this game I was really impressed with the idea behind it because I thought that this game is gonna be really fun. And as the months kept on going and going I kept on seeing how this game kept on evolving and getting better and better and the looks of it are definitely up my alley. Now you guys know that I absolutely love playing these adventure games and I'm pretty sure I'm gonna really enjoy this. But that being said guys, as usual, thank you all very much for watching. If you all enjoyed this and want to grab the game for yourselves, check out the link down below in the description because I'm gonna provide ways for you guys to grab the game for yourselves, as I always do with all the games that I feature on this channel. And also let me take a quick moment here to thank the developer for providing a review copy to share the game with you all. And that being said, sit back everybody, relax, and let's jump into the adventure together. The moon hangs heavy in the late night sky, yet the Pope's still full. Let's have a look why. The day was long and offered nothing of cheer. How about a story over a mug of beer? Crowd around all who dwell here. I'm Jack. Call me the storyteller. Quiet down and lend me your ear. I know exactly what you want to hear. I'll spin you a yarn, and before I'm through, you'll be as sure as I that every word is true. It's about a brave little girl with hardly a fear, who looked for her life like any of these kids here. But wait, who's this stumbling onto the stage? A round of applause for our leading lady. Act one. Her name Circus. is Abby. Oh man, that was such an, inter an interesting introduction to the adventure, eh? And of course, she this is going to be our character. She lived in a quaint little village just like... like this one. Trust me, it's not so important where you are from. Even the meekest hick town has stories galore. So that one I'm telling might as well be yours. It's really cool though. I'm absolutely loving this. So apparently we're kind of controlling a puppet here. Because you can even see the strings controlling her. That is so cool. And I think the characters in the background there also have strings being controlled, of a course. A little circus was in town, traveling their route, wooing the locals wherever they were about. And hmm. amongst all these hey, passers-by, here's Abby. Would you like to say hi? Hold RT and move to push or, or pull objects. All right, let's try to do this then. So, ah, so this is how you pull and push things. Interesting. Of course, the game is going to be a platformer from what I know, right? But it's also going to have a beautiful story tied to it. And as you guys know, I absolutely love playing story games. Man, but this looks so lovely though. I love it. And it's definitely going to get even better and better as we keep progressing here. <laughs> Seriously, is she, is she actually juggling? I mean, the game is called The Juggler's Tale, eh? Look at how gorgeous this is. They have done an absolutely gorgeous job with it. Uh, the environment, though, it's really beautiful. Come on, Abby. Show us what you're made of. Wait, what was that? Oh, look at this. The strings that are attached to my character are actually moving things around as we try to cross. That is really cool. What? Uh, we gotta hold on to RT to interact with objects. How do I do that? Oh, we got a ball, never mind. And aim, and shoot. Not bad. Well done, eh? Huh. Or do you think I'll be selling you short? Interesting. I love that I'm getting more. Hold up, can I actually use it to open up something on this side, maybe? She's not here by chance, though. No, this isn't a visit. This is her home. Fortune has deemed her artiste extraordinaire, though not extraordinary enough to command her fair share. The ringmaster announces, Attention! The artiste! A meager little girl child confronts the beast. Help! I'm afraid I've dropped my cap. Someone to the rescue! Can I be saved by scout? Oh gods, 
Am I supposed to do something here? I think I'm supposed to grab that hat, right? But how? Because if I do get too close to him... Oh god! <laughs> He's gonna push me away, of course. So I'm guessing I'm supposed to maybe jump up there, but... I believe I'm gonna need this. So let me try to pull this up a little bit towards me. Let's make like a platform for me to jump higher. Now, can I maybe use the ball to throw at the bear? I don't know. Well, let me try that. And jump on the rope. There we go. <laughs> and jump. Perfect. Now, how am I supposed to... Oh, God. Well done. You've almost got it. Don't stop huh. now. Use your wit. Oh, yeah, I knew it. I'm supposed to throw this at the bear? <laughs> oh, I'm giving him food. I get it. Give him apples, right? Is that what I'm doing? Oh, maybe I'm supposed to throw this away so that the bear goes after it. And while he does that, I'm gonna be able to go ahead and grab the hat. There we go. We got it. Phenomenal, awesome. Abby. Do tell. The ringmaster praises. You've mastered that well. But now the hours have wild away. That was the last performance of the day. Alas, when she's not before the cheering crowd, Abby's life is far from proud. You had the Wait, audience what? cheering for more. The ringmaster praises and then locks the door. Poor wow, Abby, no held way. in a small cage day and night, only free for the length of a staged fight. Food and lodging, if you eat like a bird, but... Oh, how she longs to see the world. Are you kidding me? What's this, this guy's holding a me inside of a cage? Take heed and bring an apple in her hour of need. Hey, buddy. Thank you. Oh, man. Can I actually throw the apple to the bear? No. Can I eat it? Hmm. I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to throw this at something, but I'm not quite sure exactly at what. Oh. Hmm. oh! The ringmaster storms in, disturbed it seems. What's going on here? He stumps and screams. Interesting. So I made a little bit of noise getting the ringmaster to come over, but that didn't really do much. And these sellers are bringing hmm, another apple. So I guess I'm supposed to figure out what I gotta do next. Are you kidding me, dude? I was not expecting to be held inside a cage. Ooh. <laughs> I made more noise. Oh, maybe as the ringmaster is going to bend, I'm going to be able to grab the key? That's right. Should she got suffice it. with the bars of a cage? No. She belongs on the world's wide <laughs> open stage. Impertinent? That means brash. Don't tell me you wouldn't make a dash for it. I absolutely love it that this game is going to have puzzles like this. It kind of feels like a point-and-click adventure game here. A little bit, at least. And carefully... Here we go. We're carefully, out. Don't make a sound. She slips away from the ringmaster's grounds. Can I maybe release oh, oh, the bear? Abby knows too well how his captivity feels. Raging beast? Hardly. A trusted friend also wanting to flee. Wait, did he just say poor Urs? Because Urs is actually how you say bear in Romanian. <laughs> Are you kidding me? That was so cool. Uh, how do I... Oh, there we go. We can release it. There you go, buddy. You're free. Oh, man, I love it. All right, so we got the fill of free. Abby, Abby, mm. don't you see? The threads holding you up also hold you back. Wow, the threads are holding me back? Oh, Without the bear is going to help me up? Friends and no. Those are very few. Your dreams will stay dreams and never come true. Oh, man, that is so epic. Now, my question... Oh, hold up. Hold up, bear. I'm trying to figure out how to get this... Um, I'm guessing I got to pull this up, maybe, yeah, so that the bear can also come to me. Duh. Hopefully no one oh, God. heard that. That made noise. Did it? 
Well, I think you gotta pull or push this. I'm not quite sure. Where am I supposed to go? Can I maybe? What business does Abby have here? No, no, no. I was Only trying to see if I can forward, get like a tool. Or cower in fear. No, 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 no. We're not cowering in fear. We gotta get out of here. Now, what is this all about, though? What am I supposed to do with this cart? I was thinking that maybe the bear could help me. But, I mean, this has like a pull lever on it. Oh, but the bear needs to help me. Yeah, there we go, because I'm not strong yeah, enough. Yeah, there, dear Abby. You can move mountains. Good job, buddy. And look at that. Was We're getting back it? up. All this trouble? Us and Abby can continue their struggle. But, what's that? The ringmaster! Oh no! no, no fast. The bear jumped down to help oh, us because we're going ah, very slow. The loyalty of a beast, so often attributed to the heart. Oh but man! Perhaps the deficiency of the intellect. Apparently, Urs found Abby's cage to be smaller than his own. Well done, Urs. Though, now she's alone. Quick now, Abby, run away! Don't look back. It's a start of a new day. Oh man, I kind of feel a little bit bad for Urs. <laughs> Although, the way I'm gonna call him in Romanian, it's Urs. <laughs> that is so funny. The name is so cool. Act 2. A new world. There we go. We're out. That was pretty cool. Abby wanted the world. And it shows itself at its best. The fields, the flowers. But you can't afford to rest. The voices pursuing her, they slowly subdue. To wind, stroking grass, cricket orchestras, sounds all so new. I also love these type of games where we have like a narrator narrating everything stone that's happening in the background. Stone by stone, tree by tree, world without commands, it's strange to be free. The evening sky paints the air, coloring over Abby's despair. Oh my god, this is so gorgeous. This is exactly why I was waiting for this game to come out, because I knew it's gonna look as good as this one. I just saw like a few screenshots and videos provided by the devs, but nothing really Sun in depth. Sunbeams tingling with warmth, inviting you, continue forth. The world is beautiful, Abby. Look at its colors. Take it in while you exactly. can. Exactly. Enjoy the wonders. Oh my it's God, just so a windmill good. standing still, perhaps envying you for your free will. Huh. It is what it is, a stubborn wooden thing. Still, you can't get past it with your strings. Okay, so we cannot get past something, so I'm supposed I gotta turn something on? I feel like I gotta get the cow there in the distance. Uh, I think I know what I gotta do. Yeah, I gotta turn this like that, to give the cow water, and now she moves. That's ah, the way. There we go. The mill waves, Abby. Hey, buddy. Its arms swinging high in the sky. That was so cool. So the game is gonna have like these puzzles that you gotta figure out in order to keep on progressing, going further. Because our strings are gonna be something I'm gonna also have to pay attention for, not just Abby. Jesus, but this looks so gorgeous. Good job, Dez. Absolutely good job. And I'm not just saying this that the devs had gave me a key code here to check out the game out. Um, I'm just saying this because this is truly, really beautiful. I mean, look at this. As you guys know, I'm a huge, uh, I'm a huge adventure fan, and when adventures also look as good as this one, I'm just gonna really enjoy them. Little Abby stops with a shiver. Oh, so you cannot go if in the you water. If you want to be free, you would uh -huh. have to cross the river. Interesting. Uh, I'm guessing in order to cross the river, I'm probably gonna have to do something about this. Maybe use like a plank over here to step on it? I don't know. Ooh, here we go. Um, so how do I cross forwards? Oh no, that's not gonna work. I think I'm gonna need like another oh, plank. My angel. I command the ground not to be painful. <laughs> Hold up, let me go ahead and look for another plank then back here somewhere. 
we have like another plank? Oh, we do have another plank here. Interesting. There we go. Alright, let me throw this one as well. And this should probably be it. Oh, we can grab this one back. Resourceful little uh, lass. Where there's no bridge, she uses her class. Uh -oh. oh, well, that's not gonna Without work. Without tools, determination comes up empty. Mm. May I lend you a strain? Lest fatigue be too tempting. Uh, I'm not gonna say no to a little bit of help. So, can I just jump? <laughs> yes, See? there you we can go. Trust me. Oh my god, the narrator is gonna be helpful though, I love it. Similar to kind of the narrator in The Lost in Random. Alright, let's keep on going then. It kind of feels like we're going in the deep forest, and it's kind of a gonna start feeling cabin. a little bit scary. A light looks inviting, eh, Abby? Warm and bright. Oh, wouldn't that be fabulous? Man, this is so beautiful. Look the, at the old dog. wolf is dying. Leave him in peace. His troubles oh. are over. Yours are yet to be. The old wolf is dying, leaving him peace. Oh, I think he's being captured, actually, and he's being held in here. I would definitely love to help him out, though. But I'm not sure how to do that. Uh, let me just... Come on. Make a path through here. Come on. Ugh. Come on, Abby. Oh, this one is going up. Hmm... The thing is, I really want to try to help the wolf out, but I don't know if I... Can I? Oh! Interesting. Can I help him out? So that's not gonna work. What if I pull it this way? Hmm. Interesting. Yeah, I really want to help him out. I don't want to leave him cut up in here. So I'm going to be able to find something to help free the wolf out. Because this is not working. And if I pull it this way either... Is he working? Yeah, it's not releasing him. So maybe we got to do something. Find something on this other side and then come back. So let me try to do that. Come on. Slowly. Ugh, we got it. Perfect. Oh, it's now sitting still? Oh, it's sitting still because I'm sitting on it. Never mind. Uh, let's see. Hmm. A girl who moves windmills will certainly manage to get a little card out of the way. Interesting. Now, the problem is... I think I gotta do something with this card and the wolf. So let me try to figure this out. Come on, hurry! No, 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 oh, dang it. You know what? What if I just leave this thing here? I just sit on the bridge. I mean, this is not doing anything. Because as soon as I step on the bridge. Ooh! Never mind! We got it! There we go. Perfect. At least I hope this is how you do it. I don't even know. I don't even know. Alright, so we got the car to this side. Can I maybe connect this thing to the wolf over here? Mm, Abby, what are you Ooh. doing? It worked. The, the strings? What are you doing with the strings? Stop that. The wolf has lived his life. Let him be. What the? What did I tell you? Wait, I released it. You have it doesn't to need do no what strings. I say. If you don't listen to me, I can't help you. Got it? What do oh we care God. what's happened to a wolf? The wolf is yonder to become dog fodder. And who freed him from the planks? Heroic Abby. Yet not a <laughs> single word of thanks. I absolutely love that. So although I was not meant to do that, maybe I could have definitely just get rid of the um, car by simply pushing it in there. I definitely didn't have to free up the wolf, but I just wanted to do it to see what happens. And that was really interesting. I was not expecting that. 
But now that we've done that, we can of course cross. Oh my god, the puzzles in this game are gonna be so good though. I absolutely love it. If it's gonna have so many puzzles like that, it's gonna be perfect. And look at this, we got ourselves a torch. The trees block Abby Take with it. wooden claws, but they're afraid they'll burn their paws. Yep, because I do have a little bit of fire. Oh no, it's gonna rain! It's gonna turn off my fire. Mud, thunder, and lightning are terrible opponents. Come on, Poor little let Abby me through. Has to endure some trying moments. Yeah, hold up, let me Alone grab another in the one here. World, she runs wildly about, while the embers of freedom are slowly doused out. Well, yeah, that's fine, well, that's fine. Abby, we got another one. The world isn't all campfires and song. Hey, I, it's a sorry state of affairs. No, the fire is dying. There we go, good job. Abby, Abby, oh, dang it. you know you can't crawl under anything. I know, you know sorry. Well it catches your string. Yeah, you and I... surprised that rain comes from the heavens. Are you likewise surprised that water makes you wet? <laughs> I'm not, but... I was just trying to be... Oh, dang it, yeah, that's not working. I feel like I gotta go underneath this tree somehow, though, if I don't want the fire to turn off. So if I sit underneath it here... It is kind of... Hmm... Staying on. But how am I supposed to go underneath it? Because as soon as I go out, look at that, yeah. It's kind of burning out a little bit. It's not gonna work. Hmm. Oh, maybe I'm supposed to pull like a few of them along the path? So what if I drop one here? Oh, what if I just drop it? Ah, very clever. There we go. And now I can go down here and drop grab it. Interesting. That was smart. Love it. As I was saying, the puzzles in this game are going to get even more and more Abby. interesting. Yeah, I know. Oh, we can also throw it if you want to. Are you kidding me? I've heard tales of creatures in these woods. Dangerous vermin, up to no good. Oh my god, is that a freaking spider? It is, look at all the spider webs. Jesus, that is creepy. Uh, hold up, the fire kind of ran off here. I think I'm supposed to maybe throw this one. Although, I'm not sure how this is going to work though. Is it going to turn off if I throw it? Come on, Abby. There we go, we got it, we got it. Perfect. Maybe I'm just supposed to throw it at the spider. There yep, she is right in front of me. Legs, ready to Get out of here. You, catch you in her web. Oh no. Well, that didn't do nothing. What the heck? Hold on, let me grab another one. I mean, I'm pretty sure I gotta throw it at it, right? Get out of here. Oh god, I missed. <laughs> Let's try that again. Ah, there we go. Get out of here. Wait, what? <laughs> He's burning his... Ah, oh, there we go. He worked. He worked. Perfect. Like your torture bit. Get out of here. He definitely doesn't like well it. Well done. You forced her retreat. Wow. But don't try your luck. I recommend you flee. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta go. Alright, we cross. Perfect. <laughs> I love how the trees are... Oh, man. Hold up, this one is a little bit smarter, eh? I think I'm supposed to just throw it at it. Wait, what? You throw it back? Hmm. There you go, buddy. So if I sit here, it's just pushing me back. Oh! Ooh, I can climb! Never mind. Perhaps this tree can be of use. The problem is I got no more fire. So that's kind of a problem. Hmm. I think I'm supposed to throw maybe one of these fires above it. Maybe like that. Yep, and now we can climb. Alright, let's see. Maybe that's not gonna go off. It is not perfect. Alright, what do you mean maybe this tree can be of some use? It's raining. Huh. 
Maybe I'm supposed to kind of use it as a... Not sure. Let's just pull this and see what's gonna do. Is it working? It's not. So how do I get this tree to be of some use? If I throw that, it doesn't really do anything. Huh. What if I throw... One like that? Is that gonna do anything? No. I think what happened here, if I'm not mistaken, I think one of the ropes has broken. Ooh! <laughs> I just dropped it, never mind. What if I jump? Well, you certainly seem to feel confident at the end of okay. my strings. Okay, never mind. Thank you very much, buddy. So that's what you had to do. Oh, never mind. This thing works. But I think I need it because I need to go and get myself a little bit of wood. So, hold up. Let me try to do a little bit of that. Come on. No, no, no. Keep on going. It's a little bit hard to kind of turn these things around, eh? And get yourself up. Come on, push! <laughs> Whoa! That is bad. Look at the fire in the distance Rope there. Wasn't built in a day. I have a feeling we're going to have a fire starting in the forest. And I'm going to have to pay attention. First of all, let me grab this. Come on, get it back down. Wait, is it not working? I think I'm supposed to pull this, maybe. Yeah, hold up. So let me grab this. Let me pull you. And go down. <laughs> what the? Are you kidding me? Abby! Wow. You see how much you need me? This is no place for you. Your torch, Abby. It's going out. Yeah, I know, buddy. The problem is, everything messed up. I'm not gonna be able to get back up, can I? Ooh, never mind. We got a little bit of fire here. Careful. There we go. Now, I hope I'm not gonna start a forest, a uh, forest fire here. Definitely don't wanna do that. Alright, finally. We're out. And this is the ooh, the spot is dead, and it seems like mm. I, somebody else killed it with what arrows. What you couldn't manage, someone else could do. Yes, oh, he did. Abby, Look at that. What have you gotten yourself into? I don't know, but I do see somebody on the right side there. I hope he's friendly, though. Hey, buddy, can I come up, please? Is he gonna allow me? Ooh. Doesn't look trustworthy to me. Careful. Um, never mind. That guy is not friendly. <laughs> well, at least now we know. Can I maybe throw this fire to him? No, we cannot. And I'm not gonna even try. The problem is... Hmm. I'm not gonna be able to go down there, though. That's kinda... Ooh. Yeah, I think I saw a little bit of a path here, but the problem is... This guy's gonna catch me. No, nope. yeah, that's not gonna work. To me. Careful. All right, never mind. So we know that that guy is not friendly. So what am I supposed to do? Am I supposed to throw fire at him? Well, that didn't do nothing. Hmm. Man, are they gonna be seriously enemies? Can I just burn this rope? <laughs> I cannot. Can I throw... No, I cannot. Can I throw this up there? Oh, we can! Oh god! <laughs> Us is gonna come up. I think I gotta climb up. Yeah, I get it, I get it. Careful! Alright, let's try it again. Now, I know exactly what I gotta do. Apparently, I gotta distract him. And, as he's gonna do that, I'm gonna have to climb up. 
So let me try this one more time. Let me just throw this up there. And as I, as I do that, I also start climbing up. Come on, buddy. There you go. <laughs> Tiptoe away, Abby. Get Quiet. tricked, buddy. Whoever is able to slay a spider like that is possibly not the most compassionate. Yeah, he was definitely not friendly and... What is this? That... That's a ringmaster. All decked out in a dark forest. And oh, conspiratively is. whispering with who? About what? Oh my, it's Tonda. The merciless plunderer. He's the one who tore the spider asunder. Abby's weight in gold shall be yours if you bring her back through my circus doors. Since she's gone, my world has gone black. Damn it, I want the little brat back. The ringmaster pleaded, the ringmaster whined, but Tonda just laughed and sipped his wine. Remember the bear? We caught him in a day without further ado. A little lost juggler girl won't cost but a few. Ringmaster, have your reward ready. We'll bring your Abbey back just as I told. Get ready, men. We'll be bathing in gold. Oh god, so this guy is actually paying mercenaries to find me. The Are you kidding me? The and thieves gather round Tonda, as hungry and determined as a huge anaconda. Their leader is big enough for two, strong enough for five. He'll do anything for a buck and more to survive. <laughs> oh man, I'm loving the rhymes though. Oh, come on, Abby, faster. There you go, good job. Let's keep her going. Uh, please don't see me, the please don't see me. get back to their work, building a castle, or at least a fort. Oh god. Oh, look at this. I think I'm supposed to use... There's nobody there, buddy. Come on, get out of here. I think I'm supposed to use that hacksaw. To hack through the woods? Come on, lumber! Cut it! No, no, no! Jesus, that was close. <laughs> I think I'm gonna be done with the next one, though. Let's just see. I'm curious why they did that, though, because I could definitely jump over it, right? Pretty sure about it, but maybe I need that. Maybe I need to grab this thing. Oh, there we go. Ah, never mind. I need the wood, actually. And if I push this one off... Oh, hold up. It's gonna go in the guard's head. <laughs> hey. Oh, that looked painful. All right, they're gonna have a little bit of a fight there. Oh no 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 no! Without some smarts up in your crown, all the muscle in the world <laughs> will only weigh you down. You're fighting. I love it. <laughs> they knocked each other out. Are you kidding me? <laughs> that was awesome. And look at this. We're out. Oh, there we go. I'm pretty sure we're not done yet. Once you sneak past certain death, it's easy to believe that life lies ahead. But Abby, you thought your luck had turned, but in fact, it's merely whimpered and squirmed. Yeah, look at this now, everywhere. Only thickets too thick for a girl. So where is this oh so beautiful world? Dangers lurking in that swamp, Abby. Ooh, seriously, you where did I fall down, that, Abby? That's death. The world's perfume. What the heck? Are you kidding me? Is that like a dead body? I don't like that. And I don't want to go in the Good water. Come on, get I out of there. Got you by the strings, Abby. <laughs> you have to look no. at a thing if you want to see it. If you want to survive, you can't be squeamish. Yeah, I know, I know. Hold up. Let me jump. <sighs> It's useless All right, buddy, to give me back out. Bog, Abby. I'm not trying to battle anything, I'm just trying to jump. What the heck? This is not working. What am I doing wrong? And jump. There we go. Good job. Seems the noose is no. tightening, Abby.
God dang it, and I saw that. Alright, I think I'm supposed to do something else here. Do you smell that, Abby? That's death. <sighs> My god, it's not falling down in the water. Good thing I've got you by the strings, Abby. I know, buddy. Hold up. Oh, there we go. So that's what I'm supposed to do. I could have jumped you higher. You have to look at a thing if you want to see it. If you want <laughs> to survive, you can't be squeamish. All right, hold up, buddy. Well, let me just use this then as bait. So that that trap doesn't catch me. There we go. Aw, oh, jeez. That's kind of scary, though. Hold up, but can I grab the food? I cannot. In that case, let me just go up and jump out of it. There we go. Finally. Wait, what? Are these bodies hanging on the trees? I have a feeling I'm going to be chased in just a second here. It's thunder I knew it! God run, dang Abby. it! Run for your life! Run, Abby, run! No, 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 no! Come on, come on, come on! Faster! Jeez, these guys are fast. I mean, I kind of knew that I I'm gonna have you to start being chased away. here. <laughs> thunder calls through the woods. Yes, I can. Yes, I Watch out. can. Or have you grown so accustomed to me helping? No, 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 no! Thunder grunts. And Ray. There you go. Abby's nowhere to be found. He's not used to having his prey escape the hunting grounds. A moment of grace can have an exorbitant price. Abby's freedom is at the roll of the dice. No, not the dice again. <laughs> we just finished Rusting Random. Act 3 The Village. Thunder's band of thieves has moved on, it seems, yet they continue to look, for this world is their regime. Once they've tasted blood, they'll discover your tracks. Rare is the victim that's managed to slip through the cracks. <laughs> Man, this is just so lovely. I'm absolutely loving the narration in the background there. And the puzzles so far are starting to definitely get more and more complicated as we keep on going. And I absolutely love it. Definitely, definitely gonna keep on playing this game. But anyway, guys, that being said, this is gonna be the first episode of A Juggler's Tale here. If you guys enjoyed this and want to see more like this in the future, make sure you smash the like button below as that helps the channel quite a lot. And if you guys are new here to the channel and haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and do that because I'm posting videos just like this one every single day, playing many more in the adventure games and puzzle games I'm pretty sure you guys are gonna enjoy. And that being said, stay safe out there, guys, and I'll see you all in the next episode coming up really soon. Bye, everybody!